They are meant to protect our kids in a worst case scenario, but would bullet resistant backpacks and binders work in a school shooting? Tonight, Aaron Murray digs deeper asking, are they worth it? It is a fact finders investigation. New resource officer Caleb Martin strolls up and down the silent halls at LifeGate Christian School. We uh, realize that just because we're a private institution doesn't mean that we are immune from anything that we see in the public school arenas occurring. Some things just make sense. But what about this? I am shooting at what's sold as a bullet-resistant notebook. That would knock a kid right now. Yeah, that'll break ribs and yeah. sternum. Yes, it's the small, square, black rectangle downrange. In everyday use, it's supposed to slip into a child's notebook like a piece of paper. The people selling it say it's a tool a student could use during an active shooter situation. The big question, though, is it worth it? In a word, no. There's too many variables associated with a violent attack to be able to say that you'd have this at the right place at the right time. We shot multiple rounds at the notebook, and while it did stop three handguns, it didn't stop the AR-15 or the AK. These are the entrants. One, two, three, four. These gun and safety experts agree. Time and money would be better spent on training a student how to recognize danger, how to escape, hide, or in a last resort, fight back. Which brings us back to armed guard Caleb. You can't be naive to the world and around us. Um, um, the last thing I would want to do is to say we didn't take all the measures that we possibly could. He teaches, mentors, and is constantly on the watch for anything out of place. Now, these bullet-resistant, notice I didn't say bulletproof items, come at a pretty penny. This notebook costs $150. Bullet-resistant backpacks come at $250. Now, remember, our experts do not recommend them, but if you are interested, you can go to WOWT.com for more information. Reporting live with photographer Christian Shampoo, Aaron Murray, WWT 6 News. It's really sad it's even come to those products. That's a good point, yeah. When you watch the story. But thankful for the guards in the school that patrol it. And a good story it. by Aaron to really show you what it's worth. Really interesting.